I was like, Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kai for those of you who are new. If you are new, what's up and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am reviewing this unit here. I'm sorry that I keep playing with my hair. It's just a habit. But in today's video, I'm reviewing this unit that you see here. Your girl is out here trying the 613. She's out here wearing blonde hair, honey. And I'm all the way here for it. I've been having my black hair for so long that I'm like, I'm feeling this blonde, okay? So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how I colored the roots and then how I installed it. And then I'll get back, into you, um, back to you guys with the details. Keep watching. Through the waves cut through me Hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Can't make colds collide Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight Dripping lights paint the sky Okay, so 
So guys, the wig details of this wig, it's a 13 by 6 lace front wig. It's 12 inches. I'm reading everything from my phone because I can't remember everything. It's virgin human hair, 613 blonde color, like I said at the beginning of the video. It has a transparent lace and it's, it does have a pre-plucked hairline because when I started the video off at first, I was about to pluck the hairline before I was going to um, dye the roots. And then I saw and I was like, okay, I can tell that this hairline is already pre-plucked. So shout out to Sheila Hair for that because they actually, I've actually worked with them in the past and they, their other unit that I got was pre-plucked as well and I literally did nothing to it. Same for this one as well. So they are a man of their word, a lady of their word for really showing out with the pre-plucked hairline. Something that you don't have to do. But I just want to get into this blonde color you guys because I just feel like with like the roots it really makes the blonde just like pop even more. I feel like, you know, as women of color, we are definitely getting more into wearing blonde hair and we're seeing that it is, you know, it's a look, okay? And I feel like it just really looks good on our skin tone. I feel like blonde hair is something that just really looks good on us. And that's just on that, you know? I just really feel like women of color can definitely wear blonde and rock it. I always was afraid to wear a blonde when I was getting into wigs and to color in general. I stayed to more like the honey blonde, like the darker blonde, but I'm getting more comfortable with the 613. It's just all on how you wear it and all on how you prefer it. And I feel like I'm feeling more confident with this because I dyed the roots. Now the roots, I wanted to go with something that was a little bit more brown, but all I had with me was cinnamon. So I just worked it out with what I had and I still like like how it came out so if you look at like the sides it's like really really brown sorry this is coming up don't pay that no attention but yeah if you look at it it's like really deep I just can't tell if my camera's picking up all the color like I would like it to but the roots are definitely dyed you guys and it's making it just all come together I this unit also came in like a blunt cut bob I did not cut it at all um, it probably can be cut a little bit but I when I put it on I was like I like how it looked and I didn't feel like I needed to cut it anymore because that was my first instinct was to cut it but then I was like it looks really even all around so yes I believe that Shella Hair has really good units as far as blonde units and black units as well because when I was applying the unit it's big okay so the um, lace frontal or the wig in general is bigger they do give you a um, strap with the unit so if you want to make it tighter you can I definitely am going to install that into this wig because I need it I had to really like double cross the adjustable straps in the back to make sure that I was going to be able to fit the wig on my head and I was going to be able to get the lace front to lay down but I mean that's not a huge issue because I was able to do it without attaching the adjustable strap as well. I do like that the package and I don't really know if the package all packages come that way but the one that they sent me came with a mixing bowl and I used it in order to do my roots. It came with gloves, it came with the whole set that you need in order to protect your hands and protect your equipment or whatever while dyeing your hair. They also gave um, a clip, some bobby pins, they just gave a nice little, nice little starter pack that you need when um, applying wig so I felt like that was really really nice that they included that in the packaging I'm hoping that that comes in packagings of people who actually purchased the units you know but I hope you guys are feeling this blonde I feel like it's different I haven't had color on my channel in a minute so here we are please tell me guys what you think of it as far as like when I've been combing it and I did wash it and stuff so it is shedding but I mean I guess that happens but it's a little much for me to notice it it's just all on what you choose if you don't care to deal with shedding then by all means but other than that the unit is really good the shedding is just like my only issue with it so yeah guys that's all i got for you if you have any questions make sure you just leave it in the description box below i'll be happy to answer your question for you i thank you guys so much for watching today's video and until next time i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys